Hello everyone. Today we have a beautiful looking car, the 2017 Toyota Prius. This is one of the series, you know, one of the videos we are going to be bringing you in our series of customer and car owner show off. Here we are going to have different car owners bring us their cars, we are going to analyze it, see what state is in, see how good it is, then tell you if it's advisable you buy or if it's if you should look away from it. So why do people buy the Prius? All over the world, this is one of the highest selling hybrid vehicles because of their reliability. Toyota has been making the Prius very, you know, many, many years ago. They started this thing. Why do they get so much you know why do they use so little fuel why do they last for so long it is because toyota has really perfected this thing you know we are going to look at what this car is made of and why it runs the way it runs so under the hood you will see that it's got a 1.8 liter engine this 1.8 liter engine is made to work with the aid of a CVT transmission. The Toyota has, they were one of the you know, pioneers in using these CVTs. The CVTs make for very good fuel consumption, you know, very good. The car doesn't consume as much. That's why you see CVTs introduced in cars a lot more these days. You see the Corollas, even the Hondas have gone the way of CVTs. It didn't favor some companies like Nissan. It, they had a lot of problems with their CVTs and that brought about the downfall of some of those companies. But with the Toyota, they continue to perfect this thing. You know, they continue perfecting it and this 2017 is, you know, a great one. It runs really nice, faster than it should be. So what does the interior of the 2017 Toyota Prius look like? beautiful i love this white dashboard i like that the leather is you know looking really expensive you don't have so much of plastic materials as you see in um, some of those other toyotas that make people say toyotas are not fancy full of you know they don't look exciting enough i like that the dashboard is integrated you know to the rest of the car you know the screen i mean some of the cars you see them high up in the air here and um it just looks like it was it was put into the car but this looks produced with the car you know really rich looking you start off from look at the the the, the separate park button here so it's different from the reverse drive neutral and then it really goes you know so we're going to do some analysis see what state the battery is in see what the engine is like generally and then um, conclude with whether you should buy this car or not so i want to do a quick analysis of our 2017 toyota prius my favorite scan tool is here and as you can see no you know i'm looking at the emission related dtcs and it says no powertrain DTCs or freeze frame data is presently stored, meaning that there are no faults related to emission on this car. So we go ahead and do a few tests. Uh, we can go through the, let's look at what the battery is like, the state of the battery. Um, is this your car, 2017 per Prius? Four cylinder 1.8 liter of course and then um it's calling for a moment i really like this interior this is the best looking interior from before 2017 for this toyota prius it's, it's indeed lovely uh still analyzing our battery trying to carry out a battery test and as we can see it's all green we can see the different cells the battery has we count one to 14 and all 14 cells are on 3.6 meaning that this battery 
you know the battery of this car is still really good we press m to go back uh we can now do a global obd2 scan just to scan the car you know holistically see whether it throws off any faults it's still coming back as no dtc so this car is in perfect condition i mean like you see one good thing about these hybrids is that they last for really a long time you know you could get 150 typically before before you start having problems you should have gone up to close to 200,000 mileage on the car and currently the car is around what 40 something thousand miles so started the engine really quiet really you know very refined ready to go now the downsides of this toyota prius is beautiful looking it's very frugal with fuel you're not going to get the performance you get in a sports car or a regular big naturally aspirated four-cylinder engine you're not going to get high numbers this produces about um, i think 109 horsepowers it's okay for city driving but if you want to go you know you want to drive like a maniac you should be looking away from this car on the average here i can see he gets 5.0 liter if it's clear enough for you to see 5.0 liter per 100 kilometers that is i mean with the car i fixed yesterday i was impressed with 13.6 liters per 100 kilometers you can see it's a far cry from this 5.0 liters especially in this at these times in nigeria so you you should understand what you're getting it for if you're getting it for reliability you're getting it for fuel consumption you're getting it for its beautiful look this is one of prius it used to be ugly we call them really ugly cars before now but you can see that this looks really beautiful this uh conserves your fuel you know saves you trips to the fuel station and all that so you must understand what you need before you get one of these overall we recommend the 2017 toyota prius especially one in this particular state of course you don't need to just dole out money for any prius you see you need to have it properly checked out you see how i've analyzed it i've seen what the battery cells are like i've seen how much life this car still has you need to have all those checks done before you pay for the car so we're grateful uh for watching kindly like subscribe follow our channel